where the linking book is this way. And here it is, the linking book back to Mist. Okay. Now, let's see what Akinar has to say now. Hello. I'm Akinar. I'm glad to see that you've returned to help me escape from my wrongful imprisonment. He was serious. He did this to me. Serious. My wicked brother. Do not listen to him. I warn you. I warn you. He's a liar. <laughs> be persuaded by his evil lies. I release him. He killed my father. He will kill you. <laughs> began when my brother Sears began to lust for riches. He stole from the ages mist. He only riches for himself. My father. My father slipped away. His watchfulness. <laughs> my sick brother secretly pronounced himself king. <laughs> king of the ages of mist, he said. He began to look upon me in disgust. His lowly brother! He did him! And then Cirrus began to destroy the Ages of Mist. He burned their forest. He tore down their structures. He flooded their lands. He murdered their inhabitants. He destroyed all but four of the Ages. Of course, I had a woman father. I finally found him. There was Cirrus also! Talking cleverly. <laughs> the lying tongue of a serpent. He had convinced father that it was I who destroyed the ages. He convinced father that it was I who was greedy for wealth and plunder. And as soon as he dealt the final blow, he took the father into believing that I was the murderer. But Sirius did not deal as fast a blow as he planned. Father died a slow death. He at last doubted my brother's clever lies, and so in dying, father imprisoned us both. I'm sure from which of us the blow had come. <laughs> I swear to you, what I say is true. Release me. You must release me. My brother is a deceitful liar and deserves punishment. I only wish vengeance for my dear father. He's murdered. <laughs> Believe me. Recover one additional page to release me from this prison. It's the easiest to find. Go to the bookshelf. It's in this library. On the far right side of the middle shelf, there's a burned book, which is different from the other burned books. This book is filled with patterns. Fine pattern 158. Mimic its design on the panel in the fireplace. Doing this will bring you the last blue page. Remember, only the blue page. Return quickly to me. And do not touch the green book. It's a clever trap to imprison those who have not been warned. <laughs> do not be tempted, for you will rot and die. Imprisoned as I am. <laughs> I tell you, if you follow my instructions, it will be well worth your while. I promise you that. Go. Okay, now, I, I made a note of that, pattern 158. Now, we're not actually going to go for that yet. We're going to go back to the Selenic Age and get the uh, red page from there and see what Cirrus has to say. Let's hear his side of the story before we make up our minds of which brother to save. Here we go back in the Selenic Age. And it might be good to uh, save it. There we go. Now let's figure out where that red page is, because I have no idea. The blue page was here. So where is the red page? By the fissure? No. The clock maybe? No. 
How about the crystals? Yes, there it is. Okay. And now, we have to go through the annoyance of doing that big underground section again. Okay. Now... Like I said, we have to go through the annoyance of all that all over again. There's no way around it. And forward we go. I didn't even bother writing down which directions to go last time. I just followed the sounds. So that's what we're going to do again. Wish there was a shortcut, but there's not. Actually, it would be nice if it just took us straight there, but it's not going to. Okay. <coughs> oh, excuse me. Anyways, while we do this, I guess it's worth talking about the fact that we are closing in on the, uh, the end game scenario. Now, there are four different possible endings for this game, and I'm going to show you all of them, saving the, the best one, the actual true ending, for last. What was that sound? Okay, that's the beast. Now, I'm not going to really talk about what the endings are yet. We'll wait until we're back in mist for that. But obviously, there's going to be the, the choice of uh, choosing between Akinar and Cirrus. There's two other choices to make. But we won't actually do that yet. Let's see. I did something wrong. Oh wait, no, no. That's a dong, that's south. For a second I was thinking that was telling me to go back west, I don't know why. But that's the buzz sound is west. Yep, south again. I gotta say though, this sequence I like better than the original Mist. It's it looks better, I think. You can actually see everything rather than having it all come out of the darkness. Okay, so that is southwest. Uh, there's really not much to comment on during this section. West we go. Go west, my son. Now it's northwest. Here we go, I think this is the end of it. Just 
based on the, the sound change. In fact, they were kind of slowing down. Yep, I was right. Okay, now let's get out of here. Let's get out of here and see what Cirrus has to say. And yes, I'm getting a little paranoid of uh, say about saving. Okay, what do you have to say, Cirrus? Fine, Richard. I owe you a debt of gratitude for you have nearly released me. My name is Cirrus. I trust that from your explorations you will become convinced that my wicked brother, Akinar, is guilty, and I am innocent. It is I who have wrongly imprisoned you. Imprisoned by my father. I don't know who you are, or how you came to this island, but I assume you must at least know something of the books. His father was a master of the books. He wrote hundreds of them, all describing and linking to the fantastic places and ages which he had discovered. The room in which you now stand was our father's library. It was here in this room, on this island named Mist, that he housed most of these books. It was such a waste. By now, well, surely, Father was always watchful of our exploration. We grew up under his strict supervision. But when we came of age, he gave us unbridled access to the mystic books. He began to leave our adventures more and more unchecked. Unsupervised as we were, my brother began to become disturbed. He began to take more from the mist ages than we had to Conquest and destruction of the other ages. It was horrific. His thirst for destruction. But alas, even I discovered it was sanity too late. He had completely destroyed all of the missed ages but four. I wasted no time. In warning my father, I thought he would recognize Akinar's guilt. But in a fit of rage, he imprisoned both my brother and myself within the pages of these books, designed to hold us until he could judge which of us was guilty. To discover the truth, our father embarked on one final journey. However, he has never returned. I can only assume that he perished along the way, leaving me in his infinite trap. You are here to release me. Listen carefully. You must find one more page and I will be forever free. There is a book on the shelves. This library, which is mostly burned, but has a few pages still intact. It is the last book on the middle shelf. Find it. This book is filled with a variety of patterns. Find pattern 158, recreating the door of the fireplace. This will bring you to the last red page. Bring that page to me, and I will finally be released and able to reward you, of course. Ignore the blue page. That page finishes my brother's book. It chills me to even think what would happen if you were to release him. There is another one. Where the red and blue pages reside, also resides a green book. If you touch the green book, you also will be imprisoned forever. 
Our father gave us this same warning long ago. 